Hey guys, it's Kunal, commercial product photographer. And the one question that I get asked a lot on my Instagram from you guys is how much do product photographers charge? Now, I mean, honestly, I can't give you one simple figure that product photographers charge this amount for every project. Okay. Uh, because it doesn't work like that. So to understand this, first we need to look at pricing. Okay. And to keep it simple, let's say that the pricing is divided into three main segments. The first is your creative fee. Then is the production fee. And then is the usage fees. Okay. So your creative fee remains the same. Then the production fee and the usage fee can vary a lot from project to project. Now to understand this, let's say, uh, that a client wants to get their shoot done for a perfume bottle. So there could be so many possibilities. We'll take two. So first, in case one, let's say the client wants to shoot their perfume bottle against a white background. And then they want to use this photo on their digital platforms. And case two could be where a client wants to hire the most exotic location. Uh, a luxurious property where a famous celebrity would come out of a swimming pool holding the perfume bottle in hand with a beautiful sunset in the background. Now to execute this kind of a shoot, the photographer would need a big team. Uh, let's say all the makeup and hairstylists, fashion stylists, producer, assistants, digitech, crew, a lot is going on the set. Okay. And then the client wants to use this one photo internationally on various platforms like digital, uh, social media, print, hoardings, uh, billboards, shopping malls, uh, and all the other places. And they want to use this photo for a period of five years. Okay. So in both the cases, although there's only one photo, but look at the difference in production and usage. So accordingly, the price can vary a lot from project to project. Now, having said that, Generally speaking, I've seen the photographers charge in three different price ranges. So if a photographer is just starting out, I would say that they generally or you should also charge somewhere around one lakh for the entire project, at least one lakh. Okay. Because in, in the beginning, the photographer doesn't have the experience of handling commercial jobs. Uh, and you are just barely getting started with commercial photography. Your m work might not be that good at this point of time. Okay. So this is, this is when you charge it around one lakh or so for the entire project. Then there are photographers who have years of experience, who have done lots of commercial projects. They know what they're doing. They know how to handle the commercial jobs and their work is getting published uh, for different art campaigns. So these are the photographers who can charge anywhere between five lakhs to 25 lakhs for the entire project plus usage. Okay. And then there are photographers who are celebrities themselves. Uh, these are the people who have been in the industry for a long time. Uh, they have a very unique and distinctive style and the brands are after them to get them on board for their campaigns. There are uh, the demand is huge. Okay. So these are the photographers who can charge anywhere between 20 to 40 lakhs for a day's shoot plus usage and plus whatnot. So, and uh, to be clear, I mean, I'm not in the top segment <laughs> yet, but then there are photographers. Okay. So pricing can vary a lot, but you need to remember this thing that charge whatever you feel you are worth for. Okay. If you feel that your work is very average and it's not good, you're worthless <laughs> then charge peanuts. But if you think that your work is really good, you have put in a lot of effort in understanding light and understanding photography, and you can really add value to the campaign, then charge what you think you're worth for. Okay. But again, let's say you come up with a figure that this is the amount you're going to charge to the clients. This is your creative fee. Okay. So don't think that you can just go to a client and throw this number on their face and say that I, I charge this much for a campaign. Because the client is not going to do this. Okay, okay, charge this much. Here's your money. Okay, this is never going to happen. So, as a photographer, you know, think like a businessman. You have to justify the value that you can add to a client's campaign. For and for that, you are charging a certain amount of money. Okay, you have to really justify that amount. Uh, you have to build your brand. Your work has to be really top notch. 
it has to be so good that the client really wants you on board for their campaign okay then you can demand the price that you want so you have and and these things take time okay these things take time uh, gradually you will understand how to handle the commercial jobs uh, how to handle the pressure how to deliver uh, the uh, the photos as per the brief you know how to work under pressure how to create fantastic images in a limited period of time so all these things will come only with time you have to be really really patient okay right so i mean like any other business you have to put in your blood sweat and tears to make this thing successful okay no money comes easy so put in your efforts work hard on your portfolio first make sure that your work is so good that the clients are willing to meet you and they are willing to give you the responsibility of their campaigns okay so just constantly keep working and keep improving your portfolio your photos have patience okay and in the beginning i would recommend that you target big clients but do small jobs for them because even if you do something wrong and there are hiccups in every project if something goes wrong you can learn from your mistakes improve your skills and be better prepared for the next campaign okay now if you have any more questions you can always drop in your question in the comment section below uh, i will try my best to answer to each and every comment uh, and i'll also try and answer to these questions in my upcoming videos well so there you have it for pricing and i'll be putting in a lot more videos uh, on commercial photography on a lot of important topics so make sure you subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys soon cheers bye